when you want to schedule the block or allow rules or you can do any firewall rules based on the schedule. So you'll simply log in first. Once you log in, you will click on firewall and you will click on schedules. Right now you can see here there is no schedule defined. I'll be simply clicking on add here. You can add the schedule for a specific month, for a specific day, for a specific week, for all the days of the week or for all the months of the year. So what I'll be doing here, I'll be using a schedule. For example, I'll be using sleep time and I'll be giving it the name time to sleep to block the internet access while there is a time to sleep. You can click the date. So by date, you'll be choosing it. So it will be blocking on those days only. But if I want to block all the days, all the Mondays, all the Tuesdays, all the Wednesdays, Thursdays, Fridays, Saturdays, and Sundays, it will be creating the schedule of all the weeks. When you are clicking on week, so it will be choosing only weeks. Otherwise, if you don't select the week, you can just simply click on the days that you want to have. Here you can see in this way. Otherwise, I'll be simply clicking on the weeks. So it is all the days of the week. And here I'll be blocking it, for example, from 10 o'clock till midnight. And I'll be adding another time, which will be from midnight till morning 5.59 a.m. And here I'll be choosing again the all the days of the week. Here, so if you see here Monday to Sunday, which means all the days of the week from 10 o'clock at night till 12 o'clock midnight. And then again from 12 o'clock midnight till 5.59 a.m. So we cannot have a schedule starting from this time to this time because the start time should be less than the end time. That's why I had to add two times here. So I'll be saying here night and I'll say it midnight for example in case you want to use it otherwise you can keep it blank. So schedule name is there, description is there and save it. So this will be applicable for all the days irrespective of month or date. Now in case you want to see whether the schedule is active or not right now the schedule is not active suppose I want to change this I will be adding another time also just for the sake of this tutorial here right now you can see it is 8 15 p.m. so I'll be adding uh, from 8 o'clock till 10 o'clock as well so I'll be using from 8 o'clock till 10 o'clock for example or 9 59 and this will be again for all the days of the week At time. Now you can see if this particular sign is visible here it means that the schedule is currently active. So what it does is that the schedule it will be running or the schedule will be activated from 8 o'clock till 9.59 and then from 10 o'clock to 11.59 and then this time to this time. It means that from 8 o'clock midnight till 6 a.m. this is the sleep time. So this way you can create the schedule. Now where to use the schedule? I'll explain you that in the next video.